long. Our question is, a cyclist travels 25 kilometers at 20 kilometers per hour and then further 80 kilometers at 25 kilometers per hour. Find part A, the total time taken, then part B, the average speed of the whole journey. So we shall use the formula for time, which is t equals to distance divided by speed. And to find the total time, you have to first find the time for these different parts of the journey. So we are going to first find this part. And I, call, I can call it T1. T1 equals to distance is 25 kilometers. So you have 25 divided by the speed, which is 20. So this will give us 25 divided by 20 equals to 1.25 hours. Then for the second part of the journey, the cyclist traveled 80 kilometers at 25 kilometers per hour. So I'm going to call that T2. So T2 equals to 80 divided by 25. So 80 divided by 25 is 3.2 hours. So the total time taken for the whole journey, that will be the t equals to t1 plus t2. So our t1 is 1.25 plus t2 which is 3.2. So our final answer will be 4.45 hours. That is part A. Then part B it is asking for the average speed of the whole journey. So average speed, average speed is equal to total distance traveled divided by the total time taken. So total distance traveled, we go back to the question, it is 25 plus 80, which is 105. And then the total time taken is what we've just got. So you have 20, 25 plus 80 over the total time of the original, which is 4.45. So this is 105 divided by 4.45. So 105 divided by 4.45 gives us 23 point six kilometers per hour to one decimal place. Thank you.